We're, uh, we don't have our, a hurricane. This is as windy as a hurricane I've ever experienced. I'm so glad I didn't put the solar panels up top and I made the choice I did. And um, the, the trout, I think it's a trout. So here's the pond and there it is. There's the, the thing, he's, he's, it looks like a trout to me. So you can tell me what kind of fish this is. Here he is, he's, he's got like a color around the side. Coming up to the shallow area and just exploring around. There he is, look, look, there he is. Rainwater. It stopped raining now. This is why I was saying you've got to build to compensate for this kind of weather, and, and this is going to be the norm. It's really strong winds, super storms, and ultimately everything we need to design needs to be designed with that in mind. And this is climate change. More energy in the water means more energy in the atmosphere, which means stronger winds and everything else. So all your designs need to be taken that into consideration. So the choice I made with the solar panel, basically putting it up on the roof, even though I'm losing some of the degrees, well, in the long run, if that thing flaws off, hurts someone, hurts, destroys itself, it doesn't, it isn't worth it. Well, lose a little bit of efficiency and make sure that it's fast, you know, uh, fastened securely to whatever it is. 